Hello, everybody. What's going on, everybody? Now, look, we have gotten a lot of requests to do music reactions on here from both the Eurovision crowd and from our Pinoy brothers and sisters. Yep. Like a lot, a lot of P pop and things that y'all want us to check out. And unfortunately, and with all due respect, we have to say no. Yeah. And there is good reason for this. And it's for one over on our rain channel, embrace the suck 21 where we started out. We started with music reactions and yeah. it initially it did grow our channel. It, it, it was mo mostly British uh, indie rock and roll oasis, the stone yeah. roses. Uh, like we've developed, Big hatreds from both the Smiths fans and Radiohead <laughs> fans in the yeah. process, but yeah. Arctic Monkeys also. But we love them. But when we transitioned into you know comedy and educational stuff, music started to become less of a thing that we do on there. And in fact, every time we would try to have music on there, it would not get as many views. It would be copyrighted most of the time i mean we fight copyright all the time yeah. on ets with tv shows and movies but like music like the record labels are a lot more harsh when it comes to m music copyright strikes and just a lot of them are still living in the dark ages where they think kids use fax machines so <laughs> yeah, pretty much that's that's one of the reasons and as someone that is a, a, a singer songwriter with three EPs up on all the streaming sites. I know what goes on on the back end when it comes to putting music up and content ID and uh, I, what I could potentially do if somebody were to use my song in one of their videos, I could, you know, you know, go claim all the money and I could go after them. I could yep. even with uh, like distributing my, my, my music, via distro kid or any other uh independent uh music distribution service mm -hmm. i could end someone's career and give them a copyright yeah. strike if i wanted to but i don't and just saying you could use my music i will not copyright strike you but unfortunately that's not the case with everyone, everyone. and yeah uh and and i want to i want to add this um because music reactions built areas in the nation from the right. from the ground up to where it is now yes and i've had to step away from it i've had to step away from it and i'll tell you guys something um it's this channel is about embracing the the culture of different places exploring different places now yeah. i'm not saying that music isn't culture it's a key it's an integral part of what makes culture tick and move um but what happens is when you dive down the realm of the music reactions, the the cultural aspect, the the discovery of new things, of of the different different things, it just becomes convoluted, and it becomes this slippery slope of that's all you will see from this channel, and right. we don't want just music. You know, that's a slippery slope. I dove down it. I got stuck in that rabbit hole to the point of working myself to death five six videos a day for like three months yeah yeah and, and I, I just i saw how it was just breaking you yeah and like having to put out four five six a day that's just it's that's just too much it's too much because i couldn't keep everyone happy and that's what i learned that's the biggest step away i, I, I take away I've, i took from it is you know you have your favorite artists and you pine for them you you champion them you know, as you should, as as a fan would do. Yeah. But then when you break off into these different sects of their favorite artists, that's all they want to to hear, understandably. But then you are taking away content from everything else and just yeah. feeding that one group. And I'm not saying that's a bad thing. I'm just saying, look, guys. And also, on the other side of things, the copyright claims. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It, the only other way, let's say, to get something through, and if you guys are, if don't be one of those guys that are like, hey, this channel did it. That doesn't work in the world of YouTube. Right. That doesn't right. work and in the world of YouTube at all. 
Right. And in most cases, like there, that's a channel that's like 10 years old and they did it before YouTube uh, came out with yeah. uh, uh, regulations yeah. like that or had their copy content ID system because I don't want to blame YouTube because a lot of times, 99% of the times, it's the record label. Yeah. And it's YouTube has nothing to do with it. Nope. Nope. And, and an artist could change labels and right. then they could come back and then they could strike the video and or take it down and then what happens on that end is you have to throw up text or something on the screen and that's i love that this channel doesn't have text on screen you can enjoy the content in its fullness with us for right the majority we've only done it like once or twice on this channel yeah. and directed people towards our patreon yep. if they want to see the full thing it's like henning ven and eurovision just yeah. to get it up just to get it up and yeah. see, I was having to do that a lot more. And that yeah. takes away from the experience. Right, right. Or the other thing is you have to pa pause multiple times throughout the song. Yeah. And to for to break it up, to try and skirt it through the YouTube content ID yeah. system. And which... then you're not absorbing the song. You're not absorbing music if you keep pausing it. Because no one absorbs music like that. No right. one absorbs music in 15 chunks. 15 seconds chunks of 15 seconds you can't get the whole song right i mean talk to tiktok uh users then but yeah. uh that's yeah. that's a discussion for another time but my thing is with the with the musicians you know it's it's <clears throat> you you walk this fine line right and and if you're at least my channel on Aries in the nation can be gone tomorrow if certain yeah. bands change their labels right right <clears throat> like that's half the content on the more than half the content. Actually, my bad. A hundred percent of the content is copyright claimed except or, for your video or my video. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But I'm that's cool it. with it. I, like I said, you could use my songs. It's fine. Uh, maybe that's more the numbers like 95 with you, you count like the football journey yeah. and all True. that. But True. anyway, we're, we're getting off topic here, but like music, music guys we appreciate it we love it and we appreciate that you appreciate it and we understand that it is a massive cultural device you know it we is. get it and it we're is. not we're not blowing it off we're just saying look this is our olive branch this is like hey guys we see that we understand that and we would love to live in a world where we could right but unfortunately most artists and most record labels are not cool like that and you know there's a few exceptions like over on ets ren yep. like he always shares co copyright and shares the uh thing the revenue uh he's cool um yeah but he's like one in a million 100 that's, that's um 100 yep. and, and the only time we really do music over on ets is for our og subscribers or if it's a big cultural thing like we, we reacted to the new Liam Gallagher, John Squire record over there. We knew that was going to get copyright claimed. We knew that it wasn't really going to get a lot of views. That was for the OGs of that channel. Yeah. And when we did the final Beatles song, like that's a big cultural moment. So that's why we did it. Oh, yeah. When the new Beatles song dropped, that was just a historical moment. That wasn't even about music. Right. That was something right. bigger than music. Oh, 100%. Um, 100%. But but just letting everyone know eurovision we we will we will hear the songs in its entirety at the moment yeah you know? when the uh first semifinal second semifinal and the grand final happens yes yeah yes that's when we'll listen to them in in their entirety and you'll listen to them with us right right it, there'll be a watch party is what yep. what we did we did that over on ets last year and that was a lot of fun it was that the was... grand final was long but oh, it was fun i didn't know it was four hours it, that blew my mind i mean not in a bad way i'm just like what what is that over like, it's crazy so it's it was a good time i can't wait to do that on this channel yeah. but um yeah guys we're not we're not ignoring comments we see the comments this is just kind of like hey this is it this is this is the reason why you know, right. As we right. build, as we go forward, you know, I hope you guys have that in in the back of your minds. If that's why there's really not music on this channel. Right. We like we said, we're learning about culture and experiences, and and like yes, music, and also you could say TV shows and movies are just as 
big a part of it, but like those things get copyrighted all the time. And we want, we want to be able to keep doing this for yes. a long time. Yep. Yep. So that's, that's our, that's our, our rationale guys. Yeah. You know, we say that with all due respect, honestly. Yeah. hundred percent. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hearing us out for a little yes. bit and we'll see you in the next video. Later guys.